Okay, um, I should be back. And tell me if you hear this in both ears. Should be good now. Really nice crackling, right? Well, that's the sound of the retro games controller. And here's what it looks like. All right. Now, I can't find a good picture of someone holding it, but I found I found something that might give you an example of how small this thing is. This is a really really tiny controller. This is this is I mean, this is the smallest controller I've ever held. Um, so yeah, it's really, really small. It's a mini console with 200 games. Now, what that means is, this is a plug and play with a bunch of fake retro games that someone made much, much later on that aren't actually retro games that are likely to be absolute garbage. So I don't think I'm going to be doing 200 of them, but let's find out. Um, magic egg. So we're going to get a no signal sign like every time. Huh? What's happening? Oh boy. Oh, it's really loud. Is this, is this good volume wise or is this still too much? Hang on. That should be good, right? Okay, so this is F22. Wow, retro games. Um, so in a shocking twist, this actually isn't the worst I've played. You know, it, it does the it does the job, I guess. Hang on. Let me deinterlace this. Okay. All right, so yeah, it's it's a game where you're a plane, and you play in a baby controller made for babies, and you shoot a bunch of things that look like, I don't know what the, those aren't jets. They kind of look like, are they bugs? I can't really tell what they are. The graphics are dubious at best. However, this does feel like some of the N64, N64, what N NES shooter games that I've played. Your name is John Plane. Air Marine, and your mission is to shoot thousands of the same looking airship over and over and over again. <clears throat> However, it's it's not terrible. It, it's probably one of the, it, it controls fairly well. It's not Action 52, and um, it's just kind of boring and obviously very repetitive. And all you have to do is just hold the button down and move from side to side. Come on, it's time to get bored of video games! So that was F-22. This is a racing fighter. Oh god, it just hit me now. There's 200 of these fucking games. So racing fighter, is this gonna be like Jackal? No, it's just, uh... It's kind of like Spy Hunter, actually. So it's just kind of rip-offs of NES games that, that they didn't have to pay licensing fees for, so they rebuilt them. Uh, fucking hell. Oh, I'm out of bullet. Bullet is gone. So now it's just generic racing game. If you listen closely to the buzzing, it's like a low enough theta wave that'll actually put you and your brain into a state of spiritual awakening, same as the effects of DN DMT give. So before bed at night, listen to this, that buzzing noise, and just let it overtake you. Overtakes me. It's garbage. Yeah, it's, 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 it's not good. Again, just bootleg NES games. Vang Vard. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. Oh, wait, no, that's supposed to be a U. Vanguard. That U looks suspiciously a lot like a V. The name of this game is Vangvard. 
All right, so I'm in a tank. Stage one. Oh, there's various stages. Look at this. Now this is more like Jackal. Except it's dreadfully slow. The fun of Jackal was that it was fast. You were in a Jeep. But since this Vangvard tank is extremely slow... You kind of just sleep your way through the levels. sleeping yet. Again, not not the worst plug-and-play games I've ever played. Dreadfully boring, but I guess it's better than non-functional. Look, it even takes... Look how long it takes for the fucking tank to respawn! Holy fuck. Some say this game works best as a sleeping agent, so if you're having problems sleeping, you load up a, a rousing game of Vangvard, which sounds like a sleeping drug, and it helps you get to sleep. Move on. Next game. No signal. Animal blockies. Fake Looney Tunes. What is this? Okay. <laughs> okay! You just match the animal blocks. And then they explode. Those poor animals explode into a puff of blue smoke. You'd think it would be hard to fuck up an analog stick, but this is definitely a fucked up analog stick. It's just shitty Mahjong... ...with animals. The funniest thing about this plug-and-play so far is... ...that there's some really bizarre names. Like Magic Joni. <laughs> Who's Magic Joni? Oh, there he is. There's Magic Joni. Because nutrition sucked. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. No, no, I need to read all of this. It's going by too fast. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Because nutrition sucked by the huge monsters, soar all the plants. The green land is becoming too wasteland and Pipoles lives. Till one day a little hero called Johnny has come up, he must defeat all the monsters. I can't read it! It doesn't give me a chance to read the, the glorious dialogue. But <laughs> Johnny has an incredible plant attack that kind of works when you want it. Doesn't, it only faces right? Yeah, it only faces right. Oh god. Oh, this one's- this one's now- now we're getting to garbage territory here. Oh, I see. No, 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 hang on a minute. I lied, because you have one button- It's weird, because the button closest to the right of the screen, the B button on this controller, does the left plant. And the A button, which is on the left, does the right plant. Whoops. I really want to read that. That was a sick laugh, by the way. That was a really, really sick one. What's this? Uh, let's see. The plant's shriveling one. Atmosphere of peace has been destroyed. Pipoli's lives were also threatened by monsters. He must defeat all these ma monsters by his magic flower. That is fucking amazing. I'm pretty sure shrivel was spelled shival. This is truly a bizarre collection of games. all these games, though. Looks like he's wearing underwear on his head. Oh, 
Unlike Action 52, Joni does not die when he goes off a ledge. Oh shit, look at that enemy. That enemy looks like it's survived Vietnam. Jesus. That look. Could you imagine surviving Nam only to be swallowed by a massive fuck plant? These are not good times. That's what happens when all the nutrition is suck. This game is fucking boring as shit. Next. Aerial Warfare. It's gonna be another plane game, right? Yep. Oh, god. What is this perspective? Ugh. Oh my god, I'm, I'm shooting, like, bolts? Like, crossbow bolts? This is, this is truly... Truly garbage. Because, you, you can't see what the fuck you're shooting. You can't see where you're gonna shoot. My bolts are going through enemy planes. Um, moving... What? Oh, I guess, I, I guess that was, um... Yeah, you can't crash into that. You can go up and down in the weirdest fucking way possible. This attempt at 3D with NES graphics is not working. And this is not music. This is a random music generator. Oh. It, it, yeah, you can you can control when it, you can control your altitude, but it's done in such a way that it, it, it interferes with how you move right and left. Wow. Hitler wins. Okay, so I know what's going on. They put the first few games. The first first few ones are, are the good ones. The rest of these are going to be garbage. Crystal Ball. Pin- Pindable. Crystal Ball. Okay. Come on, Retro Games. Controller. 201. In one. Get me some good games. <clears throat> Pink Pac-Man. It's like, what if Pac-Man was not fun? and wide open. That's this guy. This is what happens when Hitler wins the war. These are what video games are like. Oh my god. Come on, fucking move! Yo, a D-pad would be great for these games, but no, I have a joystick that only moves in four directions, and it often gets stuck. Oh, it's terrible. Give me a fucking D-pad, please. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's whatever. You, you just saw the whole game. Um, Police Dog Lacey. Not Lassie, Lacey. The dog is kind of lazy. Wow, that's a real dog. That's just a real dog, but pixelized. Look at it. <laughs> Spam your puppers, everyone. I'm gonna regret that in a minute, aren't I? The Cock Goblin Bandit. Is that a gun? Wait a minute, what's... What's happening here? I have no control over this. Is this a cutscene? What, what am I doing? What is this? The Pickle Goblin has stolen all the things. You are Lassie. Lacey. Find them. I found cocaine, everyone. <laughs> Dog just found cocaine. Uh-oh, you can't find bombs. You don't want to find bombs because they make you explode. You just watch the dog die. Jesus fucking Christ, this is a weird concept for a video game. Ah, uh, there we go. Find that coke. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Rip pupper. Again with the music. Piercing. If needles were MIDI, this is what they would sound like. Wow, look at 
that animation. Skate pupper. The only thing that's missing is a skateboard. Seriously, this is what a dog skateboarding would look like? Sans the skateboard. Holy fucking god. I knew it was possible. I wrote a thesis on this in college. I, I didn't. Yeah, I found the cocaine. Victory. This is the first time I've played a game where if a dog finds a bag of cocaine, you win. Truly glorious. And then there's this fucker. Why is he green, though? Like, I don't understand. Is this supposed to be a goblin? A pickle? A human? I don't know what it is. Well, whatever it is, I'm- I'm done. I found the cocaine. I'm- I'm good. Well, that's... We're not even 10% done. Police versus thief. Oh, man. This might have to be a multi-part stream. I might have to come back to this eventually. Violent chasing. But I thought it was called police versus the- or whatever. It says this is catch out. Catch out. What the fuck does that mean? So this is that, that uh, blanket that everyone had when they were five. But playable. Catch out. Yeah, there's no music. Just uh, a gentle buzzing. I'm not, I'm not really sure what classifies this as violent or as a game. S seriously, you can't press any buttons. You can't control your car. The car is on an automatic course. And the only thing you can do is change the direction when it gets to a direction. That's it. Catch out. So... Did I say blanket? I meant carpet. It's the carpet that everyone had. You can use a carpet as a blanket if you're poor, I guess. I don't know. No, not F-22. Please, no. Um, people wanted me to try magic egg. And I know this is one... I'm going to do this one out of order. Because this is a heavy request. We gotta see what magic egg is. I feel like I'm on acid. No, I'm, I'm, f I'm tripping balls right now. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to electrocute them? I... I don't know what's going on. Yo, I think I have to electrocute the things just as they're born. This is... This is... Crazy! If they look evil, you have to kill them. You have to mercy kill them before they can turn into even greater demons. That's my guess about what's happening here. See, now that starfish, that star or whatever it is, was fine because I lost points. Th this is, this is violent, barbaric. This is disgusting. And I love it. It doesn't seem like there's any real objective or time limit or anything. It's just, just go forever. Just go forever. <laughs> I mean, this didn't disappoint. Yeah, so Magic Egg, good choice, guys. Good fucking choice. Uh, a Pong Pong? Maybe, maybe this will be less violent? Maybe it's just a nice game of Pong? Oh, whoops, I pressed the wrong button. <clears throat> Still sick, by the way. Getting a little bit better, bit better each day, so today is the best I felt. I sound a little better than I did yesterday, but I still am a little sick, so I apologize for the, the horse throaty frogginess. But what are frogs? Oh, fuck. What's, oh, no, what is this garbage? Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, I don't even know what I'm controlling. 
it's it's rare that five seconds into a game or more, I still don't know what I'm doing. What am I supposed to do? So I'm the red car, I think. And it controls a bit like Tomb Raider, in the sense that you have to push... Not Tomb Raider, but you have to push left to turn your the front of your vehicle, or whatever this is, left. I, I don't know what the objectives are here. Um, what? I think I'm surmising that I have to knock the blue vehicles, the hovercraft, into the holes. But I, I don't fully know that for sure. The controls are fucking terrible. It's just really bad tank controls. And, um... It's so unpredictable. Like, when you crash into something, you don't know where it's gonna go. Move on. Really bad. Um, power robot. It's, it's gonna be Mega Man, isn't it? Super fighting robot. It's Mega Man. Oh, okay. It's one of these games. This, this has been in some plug and play games before. You might remember this. Except I have control over my character very, very slightly while it's in the air. Very, very slightly. Oh my. Yeah, it's, it's, uh... It's not the best controls. Far I can stretch. <laughs> I can go so far. That is a very limber robot. It does yoga. Could you imagine this is the only video games you ever have? You you just get this one little thing, and and this is what video games are to you. Nothing more. Pulveration. I'm going to guess there was supposed to be pulverization, but yes, pulveration. Nope, just pulveration, and it's another tank game. Is that the same tank graphic from that previous- Oh, no, not this again. Oh, it's the same fucking game. Oh, really nice, um, buzzy noise. Gravelly buzz noise. That doesn't sound like a legit sound effect, it just sounds like... a problem. So yeah, it's the same tank game with a few separate... uh, tanks that you can kill, and it's still slow as shit. And, uh, it's... it's really bad. Original concepts do not steal. I get to shoot beans. My tank shoots beans. It's about the only unique thing I've seen here. Exciting tank gameplay. It's like when Voldemort and Harry Potter fought... ...on the Trident. Somewhere in Cloud City. On the bridge of the Enterprise. Rabbit Village. Come on, this is gonna be great. Look at that. That rabbit. That cartoon rabbit, lovable motherfucker. Grag's bunny. Okay... Am I rescuing bunnies from a burning... Yes, I am. It's, it's a burning rabbit hole. Melp? Oh, help. Get in. Get in, you fucker. Oh, you gotta be pixel perfect. But you gotta be careful, because the plane can hurt you. Why is the plane able to do that? What the fuck? I don't know how much this plug-and-play is, but it's still not worth it. However much it is. You have to avoid bombs. Yeah. What's up, Jack? I hate it.
Oh, man. <laughs> How do you fuck these games up? So hard. What's the name? I love this one. Seaport Gwarl. <laughs> I've never heard the word Gwarl before, but I love it. That's my new favorite word of the night. Gwarl. G-U-A-R-L. Maybe it's Seaport Girl? Let's find out. Not Seaport Gwarl. <laughs> it's another tank game. <laughs> oh, fuck. This is another tank game. Oh, fucking Jesus, save me, please. Save me from, <laughs> from all this... Why is the water moving with the boat? It's just a river that rages. The boat doesn't move. Everything moves. Guarl. Is that the lead singer of Guar? Guarl? really fucking bad and, and sluggish and slow and you know it's like what do you expect to be fair there were a few decent ish games in this plug and play right in the beginning there and then it just devolved I'm gonna defeat this thing I'm gonna do it I'm actually gonna do it I did it Gwarl, stage one. Oh, fuck. It's the same level. Okay, I've had enough. Okay, um, Sea Wolf. Submarine game. Stage one. Fight. Reminds me of Radar Mission on the Game Boy. I have to use my radar. However, this is the slowest turning submarine in the entire fleet, so this could take a year or two. Oh, hang on. Hang on. We're, we're making, making contact with that beautiful buzzing noise. The sound of something gone wrong pervades my every movement. I thought I had to lead my shots a little bit better, but... Oh, wait, what's that? No, I'm, I'm dead. I think. What's that? I don't, I don't know what anything is anymore. Electronic farts. Feel anything. Space base. Oh dear god. There's so many games. There's so many more games to go. What? Oh, this is more tank controls. Where left moves the, the thing. Like, you, you don't have true control here, like... You just have varying degrees of direction that you have to adjust... ...with left or right. So when you go left, you move it the, the way it faces left. I mean, you get it. It just... it sucks, cock. Um, and you have a shield... ...and sometimes you can shoot, sometimes you can't. I've been pressing the button. Listen. Listen to how much I press the button. And look how much it shoots. <clears throat> okay, watch. You hear that? So wh why does it miss so many shots? I get that there's a cooldown, but there are times I press it and the shot doesn't happen. Next is, uh, oh, I went the wrong way. Um, Spring World. There's another game called Submarine I just saw. So how is that going to be different from previous Submarine? So, hey, this is a, a stolen asset from itself. What was the name of this game?
Because this... this <laughs> stealing assets from themselves. It's... What? It's just worse. Uh, look how long it takes to come back, too. It takes fucking forever. It's the other... It's the Pac-Man game clone, but, but worse. And I'm still getting stuck on the controls. Action 52 has a new competitor. You guys see a swastika? I didn't see the swastika. <laughs> Maybe it's for the best. Star! It's very unclear objectives. I guess they just assume that you'll know what to do. Okay, so you can only collect stars. As a star, you have to go to your fellow stars. That's it. And then the star grows. Wait a minute. This actually could be cool if this is what I think it is. See, oh, then you can, can, once you grow, you, you can absorb things that are smaller than you. So now I have the ability to absorb bubbles and stuff. That's cool. I looked bigger than that. I'm sorry. That. Now this is, it's basically a Gario. But it's not the worst game. Um, it's not the best version of that game, but it's it's an attempt. It's just shitty Agario, single-player Agario. It's okay. It's one of the better ones so far. Submarine. Okay. So the music is getting me hyped! I'm getting pumped! I feel like this is gonna be like one of those badass NES games that only you and a few of your friends knew about. And you can only shoot one mine at a time. It's a calculator game. However, bonus points for the music being the best of the, the plug and play thus far. There's stages. Oh look, the sky is different. An effort was put into making the sky look a little different. Uh, it hit. It's a hit or miss, but it's it's actually not. Again, not the worst. It's it's not great by any means, but it's it's better than some of the other shit I played. Um. I wish the music was louder, and the sound effects much lower, so I can hear that badass tune. Now we're in the Pacific, and now the game's over. Through man. Through... Through man? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what, are, what are these names? This is through man. <laughs> he's, he's a little... Tw he's a twat on a jetpack. And he shoots gusts of wind at his opponents. Which are just birds and butterflies. I don't think I like this through man. <laughs> he's got it in for nature. As you can tell... He's doing us all a service, so that the birds stop shitting on all of our cars. But is it just me, or is Through Man a big fucking bully? I get why they call him Through Man, because he has to pass through all the birds that prevent his passage. To where? Who knows? 
Some say not even through man knows. A boxing glove. Oh, the old boxing glove out of the ground. Oh, whoops. Well, I didn't go through properly. I gotta get through. I gotta get through. At least once. I, I'm on a... I'm on a mission to get through the fucking mountain. But why does he climb the mountain? Nice pickup radius. I don't even know if that was a pickup. Maybe it's best I didn't get it. That, that looked like spider. Oh. Oh my god. Perspective shift. And just as it got crazy and psychedelic, a butterfly killed me. Yo, through man is a piece of shit. What's the story of through man? My name is through man. I gotta get through. Th that's it. Yeah, I gotta get through. Toy factory. That's the recycle bin. Riles! I'm good. Really, I'm I'm good. Move on. Utmost warfare. This is like the original Call of Duty, except it didn't actually come out in the 80s. You will never see warfare surpass what you're about to see here, guys. This is gonna be legendary. Go to the Y Star. The music is just a clusterfuck. This is what a quasar sounds like. Oh, I, I'm, it's making me quasi-easy. Quasi? <laughs> there's, there's something in there somewhere. I just wasn't able to pull it off. Yeah, the, the problem is there's just so much shit. And I don't know what stars and, and what's like bullets or what's enemies everything starts out as a little dot it's not good 3d it doesn't work it's, it's shit i don't know see that's i don't know if that's good okay i just got spikes spike power you got spike power Someone get through, man, back. I need through, man. Space tunnel. Holy shit, a space tunnel! I knew they were real. Go to the R-Star. How about... We don't go to the R-Star. We say we did. And instead... We play a different game. Vigilant. Something that's definitely gonna be better than that previous game. Oh no, it's space again. Well, this is the first time we've had a a space side scrolling shooter. We had Through Man earlier. But this is now uh, our type. Just slow and without music. I like how some of these I mean it's for the best. But I, I like how some of the games they were just like, nah. I don't need music. But but all our other games have music, except these 25 games. Can't we just reuse one of the songs? Nah, don't worry about it. Warzone. If this is another tank game, I swear on me, Jacobs. Oh, fuck, it's a tank game. But this time there's a dude. John Dude. Player attack. Let's do player attack. 
Uh, so what, I'm a helicopter, I guess? What's going on? What? I'm, I'm pressing up. I can't go up. None of the buttons work. I'm the helicopter on the bottom that looks like a shark. It's like a jet helicopter. It's really fucking weird, but I can't actually do anything. I can't actually go up or shoot or press anything. Nothing's happening. It's broken. What the fuck? It might just be a two-player game. Yeah, but that doesn't make a whole lot of sense. It's a cargo copter. You have to drop a tank. Oh, let me let me try the other buttons that are on the controller. Oh wait, there's only there's only two. Hang on, now I'm I'm curious. I gotta find out. Let's try defend. Yeah, it's uh huh. But why wasn't I able to do that before? It. it so you drop dudes. Oh, also, again, sometimes it doesn't shoot properly. You press the button as much as you want. Does it shoot? Nope. <coughs> nope. What have I gotten myself into? This is water pipe. Stick that in your squirt pipe. Or, or water pipes. Power Joy LTD. We 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 have we have info. We we know who made it. Surely we can find them. Bioshock with really bad controls. Don't quite work. You can't skip a piece either. Oops, I just made a mistake. Oh god, fucking go up! Yeah, it's just Bioshock. Oh my god. Norix just found something amazing. This is what he found when he typed Power Joy. Classic TV game, limited edition with 84 extra games. Look at that fucking monstrosity of a controller. It's supposed to be an N64 controller, but what's that behind it? Is that another controller, but different? Or is that part of the same controller? I think it's another controller, but yeah, it's a rip-off N64 controller. I have a weird feeling, though, it's the same fucking games as this. And if not, I will make it a life mission to get this plug-and-play and to stream it. Wild Worm. That tree looks high as fuck. Yo, that tree looks so fucking high. <laughs> it's beautiful. I love that crinkly eye look. With the crinkly gra graphics. So, wait a minute, what? So, I'm the worm. And this is my movement speed. And I have to avoid giant bugs while well, the tree, the real star of the show, gets super fucking baked. Slap trees. What's going on? I just changed colors. Oh, look at that. Thick thick worm now. But wait a minute. I'm a caterpillar. Why is it called wild worm? 
Even that's wrong. I just heard a really random sound effect. There have been no sound effects except one that just went. Oh, I'm fast worm now. I guess speed upgrade. I get to eat mushrooms. So that's why the tree is blazed. <laughs> we jokes. So a moth goes into a podiatrist's office. It says, Doc. Doc, I need your help. My name is Vladimir Ilyavinovich. My wife no longer loves me, Doc. My work every day at the factory, soul crushing. I'm not delivering the moth joke. Just, just go find it on YouTube. Norm Macdonald moth joke. I don't even remember it. I've already fucked it. I'll fuck it even worse. Only Norm can deliver the moth joke. I don't, I, I don't even know if I'm in control. I had to make sure I wasn't... Wait, what? I'm not even sure I'm in control of this. Seriously, I, I don't know what's happening or how this is working. As far as I can tell, none of the buttons I've been pressing have any impact on the visuals. Very strange. <sighs> Move box. <laughs> Oh, what is this now? What is this hot garbage? Oh, my mouse cursor just got really fast. Is that New York City? Well, it's, it's moving boxes. I mean, that cannot be denied. No, it's, it's too fast for me to fucking control. Move box. Uh, well, I'm color me completely baffled. Yeah, I'm I'm absolutely, absolutely baffled on what this is, how to play it. I guess there's just various boxes that have to be moved. I don't I don't I don't know. I guess like, like you got to get each box in its own sector. I guess I don't I don't know. I don't really know. What are the what are the wind conditions? Tower, it's the Tower of Hanoi. Is that the name of it? No sound effects, no music, just box. Optimal step. Oh. Put some, you can't, uh, yeah. Next is video poker, which I was thinking about skipping, actually, because, I mean, you know what it is. Look at how small the cards are. It's so exciting when you can barely even see the cards. Um, they're gonna hold. We're gonna hold. Queens and, and, the, and the ace there. Deal. Deal this shit, Sam. Victory music. Jacks are better. Tell me what we got here. Q. 
AQ. Go. Deal. Three of a kind, motherfucker! I'm done. Could have went for the royal flush. But, you know, that wouldn't have happened. Apple chess. Oh, I know what this is. Isn't this Nim? Something like that. Or, no, is it? Othello? Versailles. Yeah, it's Othello. Um, next, let's see where we're at. Fish War. This can't be, this can't be anything less than spectacular with a name like Fish War. See, there's the fish. I'm thinking like two warring factions of fish. Wow, I just drowned. I'm a fish and I just drowned. Oh my god, it's Balloon Fight. Holy shit! It's Balloon Fight with fish! It controls worse than, than Balloon Fight, of course. Wow. That is... That is something else. Oh, there's, there's invisible platforms. I mean, I kind of see where the platforms are now, or what they're supposed to be. But this doesn't work, because fish are able to, like, swim. You know, f this isn't... If you're gonna do a balloon fight clone, uh, underwater is probably... You know, with fish, isn't maybe the best way to do this. Fish don't need, like, oxygen bubbles and, and balloons, or whatever the fuck it is that's on this fish's head. Please. Please, God. Take away the pain. Fuck pain away. But that's, that's the thing. Like, all of these games that are clones of other games, there's one thing in common. They all have worse controls. Mainly because of the controller. The controller is really, really bad. But I don't need to tell you that again, do I? Look at this fake Windows... clone. It's a slide puzzle, but instead of having graphics, it's just numbers. I think slide puzzles are, are the worst thing on this planet. And the only redeeming factor of a slide puzzle was that you get to see a little picture completed at the end. This doesn't even have that. The satisfaction of the picture at the end is non-existent. So, I mean, what do you have here? This is just unfortunate, is what it is. Taking all the fun out of the slide puzzle. I'm done. Resistant. I'm, go I'm getting to the point where I'm going to start choosing the ones with the best names. Missile command. Kind of. That was a nice little explosion. <laughs> For that giant tank that I am, it's just a tiny little... Just a very tiny, small little explosion. I'm like falling asleep while I'm playing these games. I need I need to like wake up. This is these games are really fucking boring. Hit mouse sounds interesting. No, it's just me beating the shit out of mice. Wow. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that graphic of the of the plant. The plant graphic is wonderful. Look at it. It like vibrates a little bit. Look at it. <laughs> so good. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> Hang on. Oh, I'm okay. Being sick sucks. Strong P. I gotta see what Goblet Tower is. Oh no. Oh no, it's this game again. Oh no. I think I know what I have to do, at least. Uh, you hear the controller clacking? Skill. Oh man, the skill. I'm gonna try to do a speed run here, guys. This is a world record attempt at glass game. Just wait for it. You're gonna love it. I'm gonna I'm gonna complete it and you're gonna love it. And somehow the controls are terrible. Somehow. Some way. It's a miracle. It's a miracle that in a game like this I can still have control issues, but this little control stick thing is like doing things that it going too far or it doesn't go far enough or it's too fast. It's just, it's a miracle. It's a Christmas miracle. Here we go. Get ready. Get ready for the victory. Win. Congratulations. You beat Goblet Tower. Go fuck yourself. Strong PJCC. What? What is that? A, is it a grape? Is that a grape that's on fire? Strong pill. Oh. Wait, what? Strong pill. <laughs> what? What does this have to do with pills? Well, uh, I'm what appears to be like a bean sprout with legs that's moving pots of gold. Lucky pots of gold to get a little glowing goblet of, of power. But what does this have to do with strong pills? I could use a strong pill right now after playing this. This plug and play is making me need some strong pills, I'll tell you that. We're gonna make sure that 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 is a J, correct? Yeah, that's a J. That is a <laughs> strong PJCC. It's like the intention was there to type pill. But someone fucked up along the way and no one corrected them. Frantic fishing. Uh, I'm sorry, that doesn't sound good. Brother ball. Let's find out what brother ball is. It's a uh, Pokemon. Ooh, fancy intro graphics. Oh, I was playing as a pill bug. That could be. The brother man ball is the brother with the brother man ball skills. The brother man ball is the brother, but the brother, brother, burr, burr, pa, 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 ra, pa, pa, pa. Here, let me help you. 
Let me, let me bring you back down. <laughs> what? What the fuck is this concept? I'd say this has the most effort put into the graphics and the presentation, but it's still pretty garbage. Uh oh. Oh, that poor ball, ball folk. That poor brother ball just got abducted and brought to like anal probe land. Oh man. What next? Frantic fishing, brother ball. Um, Pizza Boy. You know, oh man. Pizza Boy sounds great. There he is. There's me. That son of a bitch. It's gonna be like Paper Boy, isn't it? No. It's gonna be more like fucking Ghostbusters on the NES. That's not a good thing. What is this? Acid flashback? Time warp? There, there appears to be some kind of portal. Understand. Uh, yeah. What the fuck? Pizza! Oh, I see. They're they're waving me down because they they want the pizzas. Pizza now? I don't know if I have pizza. I think I recharged my pizza meter just then, but it doesn't indicate that I have pizza or not. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yes, it does. There's a graphic. The pizza boy has a pizza box. See, I wasn't noticing that because I didn't expect this game to be anything less than horse shit. Can't go into video games with weighted expectations, folks. Let that be a lesson. My opinion is changed. Pizza Boy is genius. Klu Land music? No shit, that was stolen from Klu Klu Land. That's cool. That's, that's cool. Toad in the hole. What? Wait a minute. Why is that? But this is the same game, but just worse. What does this have to do with totes? They're like moles. This this isn't no 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 no. This is nothing to do with toads. That's not even a goddamn toad. That's beans. That's a bean sprout. I I'm getting angry now because this. You, I was told there would be 200 games here, and there's only like 190, because there's clones. Maybe less than 190. Octopus C. I am a naked lady swimming. Alright, I wasn't naked, never mind. Uh, I have a... <laughs> this is how a lot of... I know how this starts. This is how it starts. Some of those animes. So the game is sparing us all the details, but I, I know it's gonna happen. Oh, by the way, it's just shitty Pac-Man. I don't know what that means. What does, what does that mean? Exit. There's an exit menu when I press A. That's weird. The start button doesn't work, but when I press the A button, gives me an exit menu. It's the only time I've seen that in these games so far. This is a ripoff. It's the Little Mermaid. From the NES. Character from Little Mermaid 2. Let's find out. I knew there was going to be some asset stealing, but I, I didn't realize it was going to be like this. 
Little Mermaid 2 NES. Let's find out. No, oh, wait, no. I can't actually find it, what you're talking about, but I'm, I'm not doubting that this is a, a complete ripoff. It's also Brave Boy. Oh, it's from the movie. Okay, gotcha. Okay. Yeah, you're not gonna find me arguing with you. If it's if it's a ripoff, it's definitely... I definitely believe that. Spades, jump, jump. Road Worker sounds kind of boring. I think I know what it is. I didn't expect it exactly like this, but I figured it would be some kind of puzzle game where you fix roads. <laughs> uh, it's it's okay. This isn't this isn't as bad as some of the other ones. You like the wrong? WRONG! WRONG! The wrong aircraft. WRONG! <laughs> oh, Jesus. I don't need to be doing this while I still have this sinus infection. Fuck. They send out a jet just to announce that you're wrong, and then the jet goes back to base. I'm told that someone in chat just said that the, the song was taken from a game called Magic Kingdom. So it was another ripoff. Um... Let's try jump jump. Whoa, look at this guy. Look at that. That mascot. That is a mascot for the ages. Not unlike Super Mario. Shocked that this mascot didn't catch on. Look, look, there's even turtles that you can stomp on. If you get hit by a turtle, you get a big bump on your noggin, I think. I don't know, wait, why did that happen? Does my character have a tumor? Wait, what's, what's wrong with my character's head? Did a turtle do that? Vinny, why do you sound sick? I am sick. I'm so sick, it's fucked. One of the better controlling games. Uh, music m balloon shoot. We have to see what balloon shoot is. And then, yeah, there's some really interesting so oh, oh, look at these mushrooms! Wait a minute, this music sounds familiar. This sounds like they tried to emulate the balloon fight music? Or Balloon Scout. What was it? Balloon? I think it was Balloon Trip? But it, it got all dissonant and fucked up? Oh, this is... Wait, 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 wait. What music is this from? It sounds like... Du -du 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 -du. 
Oh, this sounds so fucking familiar. It's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. It's like someone tried to transcribe a song that it, it just didn't work. It just didn't work. It got, oh, Dr. Mario? Dr. Mario music. Hang on a second. Let's find out. Yeah, it does sound like Dr. Mario. Is that it? It's chill, isn't it? Let's see. Let's do that one more time. But listen to how bad it is. Like, an attempt was made to transcribe it, I mean, rip it off, and it just, it didn't work. It just, it, it didn't work at all. It, it's, it's very, very vague, but it's, I think it is. I, I'm not gonna say for sure, but it sounds very similar. Ah, <clears throat> yeah, so this is, uh, something to do with music. That's, that's fucking it. That's an impossible movement. That won't be happening. Also, look at the Cloud Man. The Cloud Man kind of looks like the grandpa from, um, ca ca uh, what was it Courage the Cowardly Dog? Do you like how the crow is just frozen? Frozen in time? No objectives. No points. Just frozen. Stolen assets. And bad music. Okay, we don't know if those assets are stolen. Do you want me to play ass art? Okay, let me look for ass art. Where'd you see ass art? Oh, <laughs> there it is. All right, fine. We're gonna we're gonna do ass art. I was getting to it, but we'll do it now. Ass art. <laughs> Is that a hoe? <laughs> oh, didn't I play a game like this? This- now this looks fucking familiar as fuck. That has nothing to do with real ass art. Aerial hero. An attempt was made to spell Ariel, but we got a Ariel. What's so heroic about this? Is this Pallet Town? I'm like bombing a fucking civilian town. This looks like Pokemon. Glitching now? Yep, it's glitching. The, the more I go to the right, the more it glitches. Oh, I found something. This is fucking horseshit. It's an ocean. I've reached the edge of the map. I thought it was looping. Pokemon! Terrorist attack. So, am I defending Pallet Town, or, or am I attacking Pallet Town? I'm not really sure how this is working. If you're lucky, you'll bump into a plane. 
that has to be destroyed. That doesn't mean it's bad. It could be good. That could be the defender of the city. But good luck trying to find it, asshole. Just look around, and maybe you'll find it, you fuck. You fuck! Little Mike Stoklaza comes out every now and then. I, I deeply apologize. It hurts. It hurts. Again, there's those theta waves. Listen to them, they induce lucid dreaming. I'm gonna skip a little bit. Uh, pillar, high card. Some of these don't sound great. Memory test doesn't sound like a lot of fun, for example. Archery. Let's try twin fish. Oh, what a fucking surprise. Forgot to breathe. I did ass art. There was nothing to it, really. Surfka. Surfka sport. Now, normally I wouldn't click surf sport, but since it's called surfka sport, I have to see. Let's see. Skiers. Oh. Okay. Is this water skiing? So I'm on a surfka board. <laughs> Looks like the silver surfer a little bit, actually. It's terrible, of course, but... Um, I, um, are we skiing or are we surfing? What the fuck? Are, are these battleships? Are they buoys? Are they islands? Oh, man. Fucking Kawabanga. Kawabanga. Whoops. <laughs> I don't think I'm even on Earth now that I think about it. I look like I'm in a spacesuit. So maybe this is some kind of like alien planet. You cannot beat me. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. That was, that was just a different level. Surfka. Dark Castle. That sounds interesting. What's this? Oh, there's a wizard. So this has got to be cool. This is going to be something really cool. Kind of like... Oh. Well, there's a dragon. I have to run from the dragon. Oh, wait, no, I just got ravaged by the dragon. Mm hmm. Bunch of beach balls impeding my path here. I'm at the castle. I'm ready to get into the castle! Guess not. So these, <laughs> these bouncing red balls, wow, look at that animation on the dragon when it's facing down. It, it's so fucking terrible. It's, it's Pac-Man! It's Pac-Man! <laughs> it's, it's just a shitty version of, it's a shittier Pac-Man. It's so fucking bad. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm coming after you, dragon. I got the power of the red ball. 
or or the forests can just you know just change just as as they do as forests do just change when I try to get there oh, killed that dragon oh my god apparently that's thunder castle for the intellivision reskinned I don't know how true that is, but that's what I'm being told. Shoot. I have to play a game called Shoot. In now, finally. Anyone who's been asking me to shoot? I know I've played a game like this on a plug-and-play before. So, uh, whenever someone's like, Pinot, can you please shoot? I can say I've done it. Really confusing. To shoot left, you tilt the stick left. To shoot right, you press A. I mean, it just doesn't sound confusing, but trying to piece it together to figure out how to play the goddamn game, it's a whole different story. Just a very, very shitty version of Duck Hunt's clay pigeon shooting. And track and field, yeah. Oh, that's a cool sound. Did you like that music? It's almost crazy bus. That should hurt. UFO race. This one's gonna be good. <laughs> oh, I had to hit the accelerate button, sorry. Yeah, so we're in, we're racing. You can tell. Because, um... Oh, that's cool. I went... I tried to go left and I went right instead. Um, you can tell we're, we're moving because the, the, the poles, the space poles, are <laughs> flying fast me at an alarming rate. So, you know, but this is space. So, um, you know, it's, it's a road, but you're in space. That's cool. Oh, I'm, I tried to move left and I went right again. afford the extra O, so they just wrote BUM. Zero gravity. Okay, zero gravity. Oh, again? Uh, that wasn't even an attempt. Oh my god! Stolen assets the game! It's the same fucking balloon fight music! Nintendo, this is where you should be focusing your efforts. On this, not on beautiful Metroid 2 remakes. Please, go after these shitters. Same sound effects, same gameplay. Cool. Who's that green? There's a green one. Is that a frog? Probably just a frog. That umbrella, though. Two hits. Very, very unique game concept. Two hits on the umbrella. X Racing. That music. So exciting. 
<sighs> yes, moving at the speed of glue. So fast. Let me show you true speed. I'm in 90th place. How fucking big is this race? How long is this track? How many pickle cars did they have to get? This must have taken so much organization just to get this many pickles into cars and then racing. And then when you crash... Yeah, fuck this, man. That's... Bomb. I saw a good one. What's up next? Dada. This is... Oh, there's some good ones here. Look at all these good ones. Dada. Bab game. Your name, John Bab. Marine of the animals. Your mission, to kill all the penguins. What is that? that was all... I couldn't play during that time because we had to hear the delicious intro music. Music is not making any sense. I feel like there's a lot of stolen things happening here. Is this the Popeye game? Yep, it's Popeye. That's why it's called Dada. Popeye? Po like Papa? Re really? Though, is that what happened, do you think? Papa? Popeye? Dada? No, there's no fucking way. Dadai, they should have just called it then. Or daddy, or... I actually don't know how to play Popeye, so I'm, I'm fucked. Really, I've never played the Popeye game on the NES. Bicycle. Bicycle. I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride my bike. I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride it where I like. You say shit, it's shit. You say crap, it's crap. You go left, I go right. Seriously, I'm going left and the character goes right for like seven tenths of a second. The thrill, wow, the speed. Pain. I feel like I've played that before. I feel like I played all of this in various forms. Hoodle. Hoodle. Ho pinball? <laughs> sure. Oh, okay, now this is. I, this is pretty much just a blatant ripoff, isn't it? I've played- I've played this before. What- what the fuck was this on? This is a Nintendo game. This isn't even... Iwata made this? Are you serious? This is the NES game. 
No attempt was made here to cover this one up. That's why they hit it in like the 60s and 70s. So that way they figured anyone that was going to try to sue them wouldn't come this far. This is one of the first games for Nintendo. Or his first games. Oh, I see. Well, this is his legacy now. Just in some shitty plug-and-play. Totally ripped off, probably without any kind of licensing or consent. I mean, I'm still playing it. What do you know? It's the best game in the collection so far. Um, because it was completely ripped off. Wow! <laughs> Wow, what a sh what a shock. And Yeah, I don't know like what's the legality of uh of taking a, a Nintendo game and just putting it in your plug and play without permission. I wonder. Hoodle. See they called it Hoodle. They hit it. Not only did they hit it and um, they hide it in 75, but they also called it Hoodle. See, it's a different game. We swear. Leaven action. Is this like when bread gets... There's no way. Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute, we need to do that again. Guys, that was punch-out music. Okay? That was punch out extended. So they took <laughs> took the the punch out theme and fucking extended it. I'm not kidding. Hang on. That is unbelievable. Here, listen. That's as far as it is. Okay, that's as far as you get. Okay. So let's listen to it again, and this time, we'll hear more. Unbelievable. Oh, and the game is just Defender. So, oh, double theft. Same game, except you're a helicopter. And some of the graphics are different. Some of them are the same. <laughs> Oh, we're getting into... We're getting into heavy theft territory, guys. Like, they, they saved all the uh, semi-original stuff early on. Now that we're in the 70s, the rules are off. All bets are off. The kid gloves are off. We're fucking ripping games off head over heels. That's not the correct phrase. What's the word I'm looking for? What's, what is the phrase I'm looking for? We're, we're ripping games off... Hand over fist. I guess that'll work. Yeah, that's good enough. Head over here. You know what? For a plug and play, I can use whatever wordage I want. Did I miss the Star Wars? Yeah, I did. I missed the Star Wars. What happened with the Star Wars? Hang on. I miss Star Wars? What do you mean I miss Star Wars? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it is Star Wars! <laughs> You're right! It's, <laughs> it's punch out into the Star Wars theme! What the fuck? I'm dying! I'm dying, you guys! You're right! I, I, I didn't even notice it. Good catch, good catch. Hang on, we're gonna listen to that one more time. This is an astounding level of theft. That is an absolute new low. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> I'm so happy. 
Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh my god. I'm, I'm fucking dying. <laughs> okay, Conqueror is next. I'm ready for more theft. <clears throat> oh god. Wait, wasn't this... this a character like, um, Bonk? Kind of bonk. Circus. It was a clown game. I've played that before. You, you seriously? Young conqueror. Oh man, this is getting good. Space war. Let's find. It. How original is this? Oh god, this is ugly. What is this? What is this hot garbage? This simulated 3D hot garbage. It's it's giving me fucking it's it's giving me a headache. It it really really hurts to look at. Like I I'm, I feel I feel my brain synapses disconnecting from each other. In an attempt to process whatever this is trying to display to me, I don't understand. It, it, it's, and I just lost three percent brain activity. However, it wasn't the worst part. The worst part was that it controlled like shit. It was very floaty, but still not the worst game I've played in this collection. Turtles. I'm afraid. Guys, I'm afraid. Is this gonna be a Mario Brothers ripoff? Ninja Turtles? Okay, old-timey music. Alright, what do we got here? This is, um... Dig Duck? Or Load Runner. Oh my god, it's it's Load Runner. It takes so long. It takes so- I don't actually know how to play this. It's the same music as Load Runner. Just slow down a little bit. Yeah, I have no idea how to play this. <laughs> Fucking Load Runner. Yeah, I, whatever. It, it doesn't matter. Alright, let's- It's like Blade Runner, but with loads. Oh, happy birthday, Darren. AKA, I want a potato. You're now one year closer to my age. One day you'll catch up to me. Tennis one. I don't really want to see tennis one, but now I'm kind of curious if it's a ripoff of something else. Maybe it's a ripoff of the tennis game on the NES. I don't, I don't remember. It kind of is, right? I mean, I'm not sure. It actually is the best playing game so far. The level of control is very high. It's a ripoff of tennis. It's, it's just NES tennis, yeah, it's no wonder it plays so well. It's a fucking NES game. Just with redesigned assets. Like, they, what they did was, they took the ROMs, and fucking reverse engineered some of them, and then just reskinned them. Or, or they're just ROM hacks, they're just straight up ROM- I bet, 
if someone found a way to like get into this plug and play, they would find that these are just ROM hacks. Mars. Rescue cuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh no. That's a game called Rescue Cuck. Alright, I gotta I gotta go check out Rescue Cuck. <laughs> oh this is the plug and play that truly keeps on giving. <laughs> oh god, it's Donkey Kong! It's Donkey Kong Jr. Oh wait, wait yeah, Donkey Kong Jr., right? Oh my god. Look at it. What is it? It's... It's, it's Donkey Kong. Oh! <laughs> but what... What am I? And what is... What is that? It's almost... That's vaguely racist. On the top there, isn't it? Like, what is that? These, these are some really bizarrely designed... Asset ripoffs. Res rescue cuck. <laughs> Holy fucking shit. <sighs> Why are the enemies tanks? Or hairbrushes? This is amazing. I'm a ninja? I guess I am a ninja. Maybe I am a ninja. I don't know. I'm, I'm a fucking giant ass ninja facing hairbrushes and tanks. That's what- that's just the life of, of a rescue cuck. What can I say? You know? You gotta worry about tanks. Escape these goddamn M and M's. I did it. Did I rescue? I don't, I, I'm right away, so I'm rescuing the black person. And it's the blue M and M that's the real villain here. Oh, I see. I, I mean, this is this is absolutely astounding. The fact that it's called Rescue Cuck. The fact that it's just Donkey Kong Jr. reskinned. That is truly ass art. Mars, and then Fruit Pig. <laughs> oh, another space shooter. Wow. Are you excited yet? Okay, I've had enough of Mars. I was gonna stop and just, like, move on to the Spongebob one. But I can't do that now. I mean, there's just too much... Power Pull Girl? That's gonna be a good one. But we gotta go to Fruit Pig. Wow, look at those graphics. So you're Fruit Pig, you gotta collect a bunch of fruit. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Have fun. Just have fun and enjoy life. Because you, as Fruit Pig, need not worry about the trappings of the modern world. And the lovely nose trees that house the fruits for the Fruit Pig to forage, to collect, and eventually shove up his ass. Well, that's just part of living a carefree life, my friends. Away from all the rescue cucks, and the war, and the space games. Anything harmful. And I'm already bored. This is a mini game from Kirby64. Yeah. 
<clears throat> it's, I believe it. You know what? I can't even keep track of the amount of ripoffs. Like someone said, I played that on another plug and play, but I, I wouldn't doubt it. Power Pool Girl. Tank game. I, I guarantee you I've played a game like this before, but it was a tank game. Except now it's like bugs and I'm a power pool girl. Amazing. I'm being shot at from pawns and shit. Adventures of Dino Ricky. Okay. I, I don't know. I mean, I'm sure everything here. That, that game actually controlled fairly well, so I'm assuming it's not original. Um, you know, and that's basically every, like, space game ever. Violent. This one's violent. Um, are you fucking kidding me? Are these hover bikes, or am I just in a flying motorcycle? Because that's badass, if so. <laughs> what? Yep, I'm just in a fucking motorcycle. Why is it called violent, though? <laughs> I mean, sure, there's a few violent things happening. Maybe they could have called it, like, hover scooter or hover bike or something, I don't know. Dear God. Again, this is just, it just doesn't fail to impress and astound this collection of games. Every moment is a new chance to discover something amazing. Um, next is Smackdown. Is this a wrestling game? Yeah, it looks like it's a wrestling game. Player ready! Oh, I heard... Okay, I don't know if this was an NES game. Ah! Love that. That's good. We got some actual, like, simulated... Ah! <laughs> we got some, like, simulated, like, sounds. People are saying it's Tommy Wiseau. My character is Tommy. Move on. Okay. Um, we're going to get to some really... See, I, I kind of want to keep checking out games because we might run into like a Mario ripoff. And when we do, it'll be amazing. Let's check out Spar. Two pigs. Why... Why can't you guys be... Why can't you guys be peaceful? This is definitely a rip-off of, like, balloon fight music or something. Or... That right there, that's familiar. Urban... Yeah, it's Urban Champion. Come on. Listen, Fruit Pig is nice and peaceful. Go go and hang out with Fruit Pig. And you'll learn how to love each other. Okay? This is... Don't do these ridiculous things. Yeah, just, just be... Just be like Fruit Pig. Be nice and peaceful and go collect some fruit. Okay, we did rescue Cuck earlier. Um... Let's see. I'm gonna look for some amazing names. Lunation, Fear, Grey Deers, Hassle, Tunny. That almost sounds vaguely sexual. That T was a C. Uh, UU Weapon, Good Hand, Aquarium Arena, Panzer Fly Car sounds amazing. Awful Rushing. <laughs> 
Um, baseball new boxes, Coast Guard, Devil Dom Doom. Oh, that sounds great. Galagant. I wonder what kind of game that would be. Five days at Fred at Frederick's. Um, Halley Who Moto Boat. Polar Bat. Rural, <laughs> rural Goblin. <laughs> I like that one. That sounds good. Um, Starfighter. Small Dinosaur. <laughs> Abscondi. Animal Contest. <laughs> contest and Animal Contest. Guarantee you Animal Contest is better. Um, Candy Workshop, Cookies Labyrinth, Crystal Black, Egg Contest, oh my god, so many types of contests. Dejectile? Is that like erectile just dysfunction? Fated Pirate. Final Blood. It's gonna be like Rambo kind of game, right? Forest Adventure, Greeds, Hammer and Nail, Happy Match. Uh... Island Jumping Kid. I'm gonna try Jumping Kid and then Bubbles after this. Looking for the Mario clone. I wonder if they would be audacious enough to, like, have a Zelda clone in here. So, I have to jump over frogs. Amazing noise when you jump over a frog. You get this like discordant mess of like chiptune diarrhea. Elephants? <laughs> what is this game? <laughs> I love the I love the chiptune diarrhea so much. Is a game called Bitch? I doubt that. I doubt that very much. I would have noticed it. I told Bubble is a good one. Wait a minute, that music sounds really fast. Huh? help trying to figure this out because I'm having problems here. Am, am I a submarine on the ocean floor shooting bubbles at skyfish that descend? This doesn't... this doesn't obey the laws. This isn't the ba this isn't the laws. Why am I shooting the Kerbal Space Program people? Nah, man. Um, there's a Christmas one someone said I should I should check out. Mad Christmas, here we go. I'm sorry, but Santa looks fucking evil, and my elf looks like he's holding his bean cock. Oh, JonTron did this? How did he- did he do this- this plug-and-play, or is this just a common game that's been used in other, like, plug-and-plays? I call him JangTrang. I don't know why. I'm sorry, but Sa Santa looks like a murderous... 
Oh, lightning. Yeah, I guess you don't want to get hit with lightning when you're holding your dick. Um, it's Santa just ended this elf's life. This is a common plug-and-play game. Okay, I gotcha. Yeah, um, I just don't like the way Santa looks. I, that's nightmares. That just looks like nightmares. Um... All right, I'm gonna go back to where we were. And, uh, where were we? Okay. Surface fire. Bitha. Okay. That music. Just a random smattering of notes. Uh, Mario? That's not Super Mario, is it? Also, I could have sworn that I played this before, too. Puyon. Is that the name of it? Puyon? Puyon. It's it's Puyon with Mario. Amazing. Whoa. I Yeah. So is every future game now just a ripoff? Like is everything a ROM hack that's reskinned to avoid copyright? Um, I don't try. I guarantee this is some kind of stupid fucking war game. But oh. centipede. Ow, that hurts. Um, that was that was a really painful sound effect. Yeah, it's just it's just a shitty centipede. Wow. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. The amount of <laughs> the amount of ripoffs is just blowing my mind right now. I'm 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 at a I'm at a loss. I am out of I'm out of words. Cobra of Sky. Let let's see. It's gonna be a helicopter game. Or a literal cobra. Okay. Da -na -na. So what is going on? What is happening? <laughs> I can't figure out how to play the game. doesn't make any sense. It does not make any sense. I don't know what I- I'm a heroin needle flying through, a, through the sky, I guess. I, this isn't actually really even the sky, this is space. Hurts. This one hurt. This one fucking sucks to control. I guess I can go over that. And somehow I've flown back. That, yeah, that didn't make any sense whatsoever. I don't know if it, it sounded like a helicopter, but it certainly wasn't a helicopter. It just looked like some kind of fucking serrette. Very, uh, very cool. Bandits. Is that a bootleg Donkey Kong? Yeah, it's fucking Donkey Kong 3. Look at, look, <laughs> look at Donkey Kong! Oh my god. 
We did it. We found another bootleg of Donkey Kong. I'm just like giving a monster an enema. That face, though, <laughs> it's like a it's like a shit posting troll face. <laughs> what the fuck? Who sits here designing these ripoffs? <laughs> just like going over every spite sprite with these horrible, <coughs> these <laughs> really terrible ideas. Denglei Kong, yeah. Oh, fuck. That's a good one. Like I said, this plug-and-play is the truly the gift that keeps on giving. Um, let's see. I, I almost don't want to miss anything, because I I'm afraid we're going to miss something amazing. This isn't that thing. This is not that thing. In the quest for something amazing, Bounce is not the amazing thing. People are saying it's Mappy, so yeah, it's uh, another ripoff. So what's this ripping off, I wonder? It's gotta be something. Or maybe I, I, maybe there's no way to know for sure. Considering my ears just got, um, penetrated by horrendous music. I'm being told that's a ninja game from the NES. So yeah. Uh, what else? Ether. I might have to do a two-parter on this, because there's just so much to go. And I also have a Spongebob plug-and-play that you guys haven't seen yet. Um, yeah, this this may be a two-parter, because there, there's so many amazing things here. So, I'm, I'm a spaceship. Am I defending the happy faces? I, I guess... These are, I guess, moons orbiting some kind of planet, but they're all happy faces, and I have to defend them against either mushrooms or hot air balloons in space. Is that Shovel Knight? That was fucking Shovel Knight. Okay. What? <laughs> I don't, I don't, um, I don't know what just happened there, but the planet transformed. Okay, we're going to just do Blob Buster and then a few assorted scattered, it's Bubble Bobble probably. Let's see. Um, no, this is Dig Dug, no? Or a variation therein? Wow. It's Dig Dug 2. Oh, this is, this is Dig Dug 2. 2. Tool. <laughs> it's Dig Dug Tool! <laughs> you know what I mean? Holy shit, man. Fuck yeah, I'll take it fucking and make it a TV head, man. Okay, so we've done almost all of those 96. So now we're going to do another few. Like, let's do four. Four of the best named ones, okay? 
Um... Devil Dom Doom. Not worth it. <laughs> Not worth it, mate. <laughs> no music. Basic sound effects. Can barely see what's happening. Getting stun locked into a fucking corner. I ran out of bullets. Not fucking worth it. We've got to try a game called Tunny and Blurble. Blurble and Tunny. You can tell I'm bored because I'm speaking in a, a shitty accent of some sort. There's Bubble. Are we going to look for Burble? Oh, here we go. Burbles. NES music on speed. <laughs> wow! Well, they couldn't even program a turnaround animation. Could, oh wait, you know, there's a button to do that. Could you imagine this is what we had in World War II? Or like, if this is what like the Germans had in World War II, just, just a jeep that shoots straight up in one direction without being able to aim it to defend against the paratroopers. Burbles. Why, why is it called Burbles? <laughs> why is it called Burbles? Oh... No, nothing makes any sense anymore. There we go, Tunny. Oh my god. Burbles equal bullets. Burbles plus bur burtles equal battles. Oh, I see. So what what game is this ripping off, I wonder? So Tunny is a helicopter that doesn't actually fly. But, um... Advances along... Re uh... Rebar? No, um, along... Uh, what is this called? Pylon? Really, really solid FPS. Sun Sun? It's a ripoff of a game called Sun Sun. Girders. Yeah, there you go. Girders. I couldn't, I couldn't think of the word. Just had a mind blank. That was terrible. Um, I want to try that goblin game. Because I like I like goblins and I think they're underrated and underrepresented, especially these days. No one fucking talks about goblins anymore. Rural goblin. Well, it doesn't exactly look like a goblin. Oh, it's fucking rancid. God, pull the plug, please. Oh, it's fucking garbage. Oh, it's garbage. Oh my god. I can't fucking play this game. It's so fucking raw. I can't even fucking play it! I don't know how to play the game! This has nothing to do with goblins. You can imagine my utter disappointment. I can't actually play the game. Seriously, I'm, I'm like moving the thing and I'm pressing the buttons. It's not happening. Um, let's do just a few more, like two more. 
Final blood. I got, it's it's gonna be Rambo, isn't it? No, it's actually... I don't know what the hell this is. <laughs> wow, the animations on the explosion look pretty good. Hey, isn't this just that submarine game without radar? So I can fire from both cannons independently, even though they both end up in the same spot. And you can't fire them both at the same time. Oh, yes, you can. Never mind. You want Nutcracky? Okay, we'll do Nutcracky. You need that Nutcracky? I got you covered. And look, it's mowing. Not mowing, mowing. It's a hell of a face you got there, Nutcracky. Save the princess. I regret every decision I've ever made up until this point, and including now. So, I'm a nutcracker, and there's either giant anthropomorphic mice chasing me, or I'm really small, and again, these mice are walking upright. I had one shot, I blew it. Wow, exciting. Sometimes you can shoot, sometimes you can't. Oh. Look at that. Fucking shoot! Now I can't shoot anymore. I don't have the ability to shoot anymore. You hear that? That's the sound of me trying to shoot and nothing happening. <laughs> this is really, really horrible. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> That's good. I love. Look at the death animation here. That was that was pretty jazzy. Okay, we got to do one more. I I am addicted to this plug and play. It's fac fucking fascinating. Man in red. Is that? Is that Mario? Guys. <laughs> no, it's not Mario. <laughs> it's just another shitty war game. <laughs> what do you know? I thought it was Mario from the Super Mario Brothers movie. I thought it was like a buff, like, you know, slightly spurious Mario clone. This is, this is kind of impossible. Look at that animation. Wow. One more? One more, right? Why not? Meccano. Uh, uh, why is it this one? Yeah, you get a gold star. Go fuck yourself. Good! Good. Good. <laughs> Look how many different ways the word good is formed. Good. Good. G. O. O. Good. Good. This is one of my most famous quotes, by the way. Good. Go. Ood. G. Goo. Did.
Game over. I had one fucking job. One job. And I fucked it up. Um, Little Witch will be the final one of the evening for this. I'll probably return to this at some point and check out more of these horrendously bootlegged games, some of which are stolen completely, some of which are original and also terrible. Is this Defender again? Yeah, it's fucking Defender. Oh, it's even worse than Defender. Oh, God. You have very little control over your witch. At least in the Defender clone, the other Defender clone, it was, um... It was more like Defender, like you could actually fucking control your character. This is just... This is just horrendous. Yeah, no, this is, this is, uh, this is rough. It's like they took Defender, made two clones of it, and they made one worse than the other intentionally so that you'd play the other one. That's, that's all I got. Look, there's even a radar, but it's not accurate. It's just stupid. Everything's stupid. Everything's bad. It's all bad. But that was the Retro Games controller, everyone. And, um... Wow. Unbelievable. We're gonna take a quick break, and I will return with another plug-and-play. And maybe a little something else after that. Uh, but the next plug-and-play will be Spongebob plug-and-play. So please stick around. You're not gonna want to miss Spongebob. Spanglebert Babberdink is up next. And I have to use his nose as a controller, so it's going to be a real shit show. Um, yeah, stick around. I'll be back in just five minutes with Spang, the plug-and-play. <laughs> 